What about Pakistan? Have they been willing to speak out for the Uyghurs? Pakistan has also have a horrible history uh, collaborating with China. Which Muslim government or go a government of a Muslim country has been the loudest and most dedicated to protecting the Uyghurs? Unfortunately, none as we speak. Only uh, uh, Malaysian leader, uh, Enver Ibrahim, recently expressed concern. That's pretty much about it. Expressed concern. But none of them have sanctioned any Chinese leaders? None, unfortunately. Or sanctioned Chinese businesses? Um, which religious customs uh, or, um, or rights is, uh, is China prohibiting? Uh, the Chinese government sanctioned pretty much everything related to Islam, especially in the last 19 months. So if you don't eat uh, during daylight in Ramadan, what will they Foreign do to you? Foreign Policy magazine listed 48 ways that you'd be considered as extremist in the eyes of the Chinese government under this new draconian role, uh, regulation imposed April 2017 mm -hmm. that sanctioned a normal beard, uh, adherence to Islamic uh, diet. Uh, you mean... Eating halal food makes you an Islamic extremist? That, that, this is under their new regulation. There is, their policy papers have been written. Their reports have been published on this particular issue. Foreign Policy Magazine lists 48 behaviors that you and I... And the, and the foreign, foreign Policy Magazine is translating a Chinese regulation That's correct. that says you, can, you are classified an Islamic extremist and subject to internment if you eat halal food. Even greeting in Islamic way. Uh, today, uh, Uyghur families cannot even say "Salam alaikum" as part of their culture. So they're basically prohibiting the practice of Islam um, while not allowing, perhaps, a vague Islamic cultural identity. Um, yeah. And the Muslim nations of the world lift not a finger. That's the ironic world that we find ourselves today, unfortunately. Um.